Hello and welcome to another telehealth information video. My name is Garvin and today's video is on Valcite. Valcite is used to treat cytomegalovirus infections affecting the eyes in people with AIDS as well as preventing cytomegalovirus infection in people who have had organ transplant from a cytomegalovirus positive donor. Valcite contains the active ingredient Valgancyclover. Valgancyclover is known as a prodrug. Once inside the body, it is broken down into the active ingredient Gancyclover, which is an antiviral medicine used to treat infections with the cytomegalovirus. Gancyclover works by blocking the action of a viral enzyme needed for the virus to replicate itself. This stops the virus from multiplying, which controls the infection and helps the immune system to deal with it. Valcite tablets and oral solutions should preferably be taken with or just after food or a meal. The dose prescribed and how often to take the medicine depends on the condition being treated. It is important to follow the instructions given by your doctor. These will also be printed on the dispensing label that your pharmacist has put on the packet of medicine for you. You should take the tablets at regular intervals and always complete the course prescribed, even if you think the infection has cleared up. Valcite should be used in caution in pregnant and breastfeeding women, and only if the expected benefit outweighs the risk to the baby. If you're pregnant or breastfeeding, make sure to consult with your doctor on the safety of taking Valcite. Valcite may cause dizziness, so it is advised that you abstain from driving or operating heavy machinery until you know how Valcite affects you. It is best to avoid drinking alcohol since the combination could increase the dizzying effect Valcite may have. Make sure to tell your doctor what other medicines you're taking, as they may have undesired interactions with Valcite, especially medicines such as certain antibiotics and antifungals. Some common side effects of Valcite include fever, diarrhea, dizziness and headache. For a complete list of the side effects, go to my website www.lynchespharmacy.com And remember, all medicines have potential side effects, but this doesn't mean that you'll experience them. That brings this video to an end. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments below or contact me through lynchespharmacy.com. Thank you for watching. Stay healthy and stay informed.